the, instead of you playing the head or playing chords, would be to play kind of a, a groovy line that kind of like make the probably make the link between the the, the, the melody like something you know you know what I'm saying something like that that kind of like okay David let's try again I feel like Nathan you're dragging just a little bit it's slight but it's enough to kind of and when you attack the swing part don't slow down that's a big trap let it, let it, let the swing come out of the Latin part naturally. Which means don't even think about it. Don't overdo it. If you overdo it, then you're slowing down. So now let's put some like some mystery, some suspense, danger. not too bad. Uh, there is a general tendency, which I felt, especially when I was playing with you guys, that each time we, we hit the swing part, it kind of gets contrived in a way. For example, when you are playing your solo, when you're playing the, the hey sections, the Latin things, you were really like, yeah, you know, you, all your body language was very like about moving, dancing, you know. And then each time we reached the, the swing section, it was like, Jazz pianist, you know, I could feel the button, you know, almost. But if we do it, we have to stay kind of like musical during the whole thing. For example, in your part, each time it reaches the swing thing, it's same as David, your body language change. You're, you're really like very like, I don't know, uh, smooth, I don't know how to say, you know, cool. And, and when you read the swing, it's almost like somebody puts a medication, you know, in your arm and boom, you become more like stiff. I don't know if I'm wrong, but uh, that's what I can feel. 